Hello, it's Brick Bros UK and we have our first blind bag opening for four Series 17 collectible minifigure packets which we got in our recent Lego shop haul. So it's quite exciting because these four minifigures, whoever they are, will be our first from the new series and it would be amazing to get the Highwayman or Corncob guy first time but to be honest we don't mind who we get because they're all new just as long as we don't get duplicates. So without stalling any longer, let's get these bags open to see who we've got. And here's our new minifigures which include the Elf Girl, Veterinarian and two Battle Dwarfs and we're pleased to have got the Elf Girl and Veterinarian who comes with a rabbit this early in our collection but the double Battle Dwarfs are a bit annoying. However, on a positive note, they do have some cool parts we could use on minifigure creations, so it's not too bad overall. Now looking more closely at the minifigures, you can see that Elf Girl has its highly detailed purple and light blue shiny dress printed on her torso and slope brick dress piece that gives the character a very elegant elf-like outfit. She also comes armed with a gold sword and has dual molded yellow and gunmetal arms that have this flower printing on the gunmetal, which is a good touch. Elf Girl also has this unique light orange long elf ears hairpiece that has a silver brooch on the back and in her other hand she carries this light grey shield that has shiny gold and light blue detail printed on the front with a gold flower in the centre. And finally below her hair she has a single faced head which just has a plain expression to complete the minifigure. So overall thanks to Elf Girl's beautiful dress and hairpiece she would make a nice addition to a Lego Elf collection or even Lord of the Rings and Hobbit sets because she's well armed for combat. Next up it's our favourite minifigure of the three, the veterinarian who we feel could be one of the most popular characters from this series because she's the first Lego minifigure vet and we love the look of her and she wears this light mint green vet outfit that's been designed well with the cute paw name tag and stethoscope printed on it. It also has dual molded arms for sleeves and blue hands for gloves adding great extra detail the vet also has a brand new exclusive female hairpiece in light brown that has a nice mould with the parting and hair going down either side of her head and we can't wait to see this piece in future sets. And at the back there's more printing on the torso. And to make the cutometer explode the veterinarian gets given this super cute white rabbit that's a new animal mould to fit in minifigure hands. And as you can see it has black eyes as well as a pink nose printed on its face so like the hair piece we'd love to see more of these rabbits in future city sets because it's an animal lovers must have and we're glad we have one now. Then under her hair she has a smiling female face on her head. So overall the veterinarian is definitely a top minifigure in this series because of her great looking outfit that could also pass as a nurse's uniform. But the new hair piece and rabbit make the vet extra special which is why we're glad we got her early on. And last up it's the Battle Dwarf who's actually the second dwarf minifigure to pop up in a Lego series because there was an evil dwarf in series 5. Now we like this dwarf's crazy red design that makes him look a bit like a heavy metal rocker and starting at the bottom he has these dark red small legs with extra orange printing. Then on his yellow bare chest torso they printed on this brown and bronze warrior belt which is very nice but our favourite printed area is the black dragon tattoo on the top left of the chest because it continues onto its right arm which is a clever touch. And as you can see both of his arms are dual molded with yellow at the top and gunmetal lower down to create wrist guards. He also carries this awesome Thor hammer that's got a new gunmetal colour and it might interest Thor fans because they printed a bronze boar on each side which is excellent detail for the weapon. Then at the back the belt and body printing continues on the torso and in his left hand he wields a small black handled gunmetal axe so he's well armed for combat. Now moving up the battle dwarf he's got a red beard as well as a red mohawk hairpiece to decorate his head which is a cool look and the red colour for these pieces is new which is another bonus. And his single faced head has an angry expression red eyebrows with red beard to go with the hairpieces. So overall the battle dwarf is a pretty decent character to get because of his unique 
pieces like its red hair and beard, as well as its new Thor hammer, which we have two of, so we could use the hammer on Thor now, which is great. On a final note, as our first Series 17 blind bag opening, we were pleased with the minifigures we got, especially the veterinarian, but we were a little disappointed with the duplicate battle dwarfs, but overall it's not that bad because we will find uses for the spare parts. We also have plans on doing some more blind bag openings for Series 17 in the near future to try and collect some more characters because it's always fun to get new minifigures and we hope your Series 17 collection is going well and progressing like ours. Hope you enjoyed a Brick Bros UK LEGO Series opening and don't forget to check out our channel for more LEGO videos and like, comment and subscribe to Brick Bros UK.